Christmas. What's going on YouTube? It's me, Tiffany, and I'm here with my co-host, Tanea. Hey guys. And we are back with an all new video. A yes, we are. special video. Yes, it is. Today is our 200th. We made it! We made it! I can't believe it's our 200 videos. She made it. I was about to kill her. No, you made it. Whatever. So anyway, it's our 200 video. I'm excited. It's kind of um, surreal. Our uh, producer actually told us that our 200 video was coming up a couple weeks ago. Maybe almost a month ago. And I was just like, what? Like, I... Definitely hadn't been counting the videos, but I can't believe it's been 200 videos. I know that's nice. It's, it's cray cray. Yeah, that it is. It is. So, um, we're going to do a couple of things in this video, but it's a video only on the show, just talking about some old videos and what our favorite, our top 10 favorite videos. So, I'm going to start, then she'll go, then I'll go, then she'll go, then I'll go, then she'll go, then I'll go, then she'll go. Um, my top favorite number one video is the Beyonce documentary "Life Is But a Dream." That it, is that one of yours? Yes. Okay. Good. Oh my God. That's um, that's definitely one of my favorite ones because it was our first video that we got. That was when we were only getting fifth. 50 views was a lot for yeah. us. Like, that was when we weren't getting any views. And it was crazy because it was like, I went to work. We did it the night. No, we didn't even do it the night that it came on because Ashley was out of town. That's when it was still three hosts. Mm -hmm. So we did the video when she came back in town. And I uploaded it. And then when I was at work, I just kept saying, Tanea, like, every time I refresh the button, like, we're getting it, more it, views. It, that was our first. First of all, that video went to the... I don't even know what it's where it's, it's at now. That now. Like I know it's past the thousands because oh we did a video on it being right. thousand. It was that was a good video. That was a fun video. We were really excited because mm -hmm. it was just a big Beyonce night. That was the night that the Oprah interview for Beyonce came right. on. Life is a lie. Came on the next week was next couple of weeks or the weeks before that was the Super Bowl. It, it was, was before the weeks before that yeah. because this came out. I, I remember the date. February the 16th. Oh, okay. And Super Bowl is, what, the last weekend in it January? It was actually my birthday that year. It was... Oh, yeah, so it was on my birthday because yeah. it's that last weekend. Yeah. That was a oh, good yeah. video. If y'all, you know, if you're watching this and you haven't seen the videos that we're talking about right now, I am suggesting that you go back and watch them because if it's my favorite, then it must be the best. You feel me? And I'll just, you know, piggyback off her because it was definitely on my list. That's maybe we should have talked to each other about. No, that just means that we have but, something um, in common. Right. But um, that was definitely one of my favorite videos. And I can just remember how excited I was around that time. It was definitely B season. So it was just a good video. Like me, Ash, and Tiff. Like, you know, I was just looking at us while we were doing the video. And we just had, like, a lot of chemistry. We were just really, really excited. So that's definitely one of my favorite videos. Beyonce is awesome. And I just like to thank the Lord for her. It's your turn. Oh, okay. Well, I, that was mine. Well, that that was mine too. Then I'll say. Also, oh, do you want me going? Yeah. So this will be a second. Okay. Video. My second video is. Please let it not be another one that I have. This is when I don't know if Tanae Tanae had a different job at this time. So sometimes she had to go to work in the evening. My breaks used to be at one o'clock, so I would rush home if like a big topic came out and we would record while I was on break. And this mm -hmm. is definitely one of the break videos. This is when Beyonce dropped the um, Pepsi video. Oh my god! And in the beginning of the video, before we review it, I actually danced, tried to do the exact oh same thing. Oh my god! Beyonce it was dancing. so terrible. <laughs> and I looked at it today, and it has thousands of thousands of views, and it was people under there like. Look at how fat ass. I was going off. She though. really tried. I was going I was going off, but um, <laughs> that was when we would like move around. Like it depended on a day with that scared the shit out of me. Me too. Um, it depended on a day. Like some days we would do it by the staircase, some days we would do it by it the window. We would do it upstairs. It was, it was like one of those videos. So that was a 
shopping video. Plus, that was a fun commercial, so I was like, stupid excited. And since it dropped in the middle of the day, I was like, oh, hell yes. I'm going home. We about to... What? Um. Okay, so one of my other ones was my... I'll just say my first one that I put on there was Unapologetic Review. Because... I, we were really, really excited for Rihanna music. Wait a minute. I, was this when it was me, you and Ashley? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, it that was, was a hood video. It was, and that's why I liked it. It was, um... It was like a real, real hood video. In the beginning of that video, Tiffany actually wasn't there. And so me and Ashley did like an impromptu dance oh, yeah. to um, one of Rih the Rihanna and Chris Brown song on it. And we like really killed it. But we like practiced enough and it was so much fun. <laughs> and um, I was looking at it and then like I couldn't pick a favorite song. And now that I've, it's been years, I definitely have songs on it that I don't listen to as much right. anymore, so I wish it could be, I could review the thing. Right. But either way, like, it was just nice for me to watch because it seems like I'm always bashing Rihanna, or I have something bad to say about Rihanna, but in this video, I had all good things to say about I Rihanna. Have to watch so if video. you are a Rihanna fan, go back and watch <laughs> it, and then you'll know that I That's really rare. do. Right. You really, you'll know that I really do love Rihanna. That's why I feel I can say whatever I want to about her. <laughs> That was a hood video. That's back oh my when God. we would just go on the porch and get the porch chairs and just right. set the camera I can't remember what was in the That was when we used to, I used to hook the camera up to the TV and we could actually see yeah. ourselves while we were recording. Was that crazy. was fun. Uh, but my voice was really deep, so I must have been tired that night. And we used to record late. Like, yeah, I think I had gotten off of work late. My voice was so deep Yeah, we used to be video. real. Um, so don't judge me. My third one is Blue Ivy's hair. No! one of my favorite videos because I was at a point where I was so damn fed up with people talking about Blue Ivy's hair and it was like I was just like y'all like let's do a video we did the video in Tanea's mother's room that right. was one of our like, hood videos and Tanea was so funny in that video cause I, I was so remember. mad because like if y'all don't know, if y'all not like Beehive members, Blue Ivy is our baby. Like, it's like Beyonce gave us to her, I mean, gave her to us, and it's really our job to protect her. Exactly. And, um, I just didn't appreciate it. I felt like y'all was coming at a baby who, because right now I feel like B Blue can handle her own right now. But at that time, she just couldn't. So I just had a lot to say, and I went off. And it was really one of my favorite videos because you saw that I really don't play. Like, everybody be like, you know, because Tiffany goes crazy over Beyonce. Mm -hmm. I don't play about B or Blue. So I just had to let y'all know. So, um, oh, it's your turn. Oh, we both we had the same, same one. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, my fourth favorite video is no, it's not. I'm pretty sure it's not. I, it's definitely a scandal review, and it's from Vermont is for Lovers too. It was the episode where Fitz and Liz mm. had sex when we had bought the big house. It was like beautiful. Now y'all know. First of all, I had new weeks prior because the the lady um Ava, <laughs> I can't think of how you pronounce her last name, Duvernay mm -hmm. or something like that. She's the, the Selma lady. Right, she's the director of Selma. She directed Vermont is for Lovers 2, and for weeks she had been putting out pictures because, you know, they record months and months ahead, but we had found out that it was going to be an old lit sex scene, so I was preparing myself for weeks for this episode, but I wasn't ready. Like, I just, it was amazing. It, I wasn't ready, so, like, it, actually, if you watch, um... I'm going to put it on this video. I don't know if I'm putting it before. I don't know if y'all saw it yet or y'all didn't because I don't know if I'm putting the beginning or the end. But I'm going to put the old intro in the very end where I'm like this. That's me passing out on that video because I just couldn't take it. And it wasn't just me because we both are old Lips fans. Today was, I think you was eating some chips and you was just like, I was just like, mm-mm, mm-mm. And then you was just like, ah! <laughs> Oh, so that's on the yes. yes. I don't know what I was screaming <laughs> from. Because can I tell y'all something? If y'all don't watch Scandal, 
Y'all need to go YouTube, Google, Netflix, whatever you gotta do. That one episode. It is amazing. It was everything we needed. That was a good one. Because I honestly didn't know which scandal review to pick, so I didn't pick my album. So I'm glad you just picked it. Um, my number four is the MTV Musical Awards 2014. Oh, be with Beyonce, Beyonce when she had like her whole set. Oh yeah. my goodness. It was like amazing because if y'all know like the year before that, like we had just went to go see Beyonce like three times in a row. Like we were still on the Beyonce high. She, you know, we were still on how like her dropping the album, even though that was like in December. This came out in like June. But like we were still excited about it. It was just, you know. So we knew like Beyonce was coming. But we didn't know like it was going to be 15 minutes of a and We didn't know it was going to be the whole album. Like, because we were just in here wondering, like, what song is she going to do? The what stage. is she going to do? She better not do that DC3. The like, that's slayage. all we could say. It was like, she better not do that, oh you know, God. back in the day thing. Beyonce did her whole album in 15 minutes. It completely wowed me. Like, me and Ashley still watch it to this day. It's amazing. Like, I had to stop watching it because Beyonce starts to look like a superhero after a while. So it was just like, please stop it. Then we have little Blue Ivy in the oh, crowd God. getting her little dance on. Like, it was just too much. That was a really, really good um, <laughs> award show. And then that was a really, really good review because me and Tiffany were so excited. We usually when it's an award show, we usually do it that no, night. No, it was only be. I, oh, I thought you were about to say. No, I'm saying I didn't know if we did it that night or if we did it I the know. next day or what. But I remember um because we were saying we thought we remember before because the um the remix had just came out with Beyonce yeah. and Nicki Minaj and we was like oh my god like is Nick because that was Nicki Minaj had opened it mm -hmm. so we were like is she gonna be on it like right. what's gonna happen but she wasn't it was still on. that was a good um show it was awesome. Um, my next one, which is crazy, I'm starting to notice that the common denominator here is Beyonce. <laughs> um, it was when Beyonce dropped a new album. It's called the Beyonce, uh, the Beyonce Visual Album. No, first, it's two. I actually have two. I actually have a couple extra more than today because I just felt like I should. So my first one is Beyonce drops a new album. That's the video that when you first go on our page, it's still up. Like it's the first video you see. I put it as like. A pinned video, I guess. Mm -hmm. It's a like a trailer for our uh, for our channel, and it was the night that scandal was going on. Um, the went right. to break. Yeah. It was December the thirteenth, and it was going on a break. And Tanea was in the kitchen cooking. We was just right. Trying. Like I had, cause if y'all go back and watch, um, mind you, I was cooking at the scandal. Exactly. It was like eleven o'clock at night. If y'all go back to um, the finale review that day you'll see me like i started crying i was stressed mm -hmm. out we were about to go from december until february for scandal to come back on so y'all know i'd be depressed i'm scrolling down my twitter and i start seeing all these people talking about beyonce so that same night that same night i just grabbed the camera as soon as i found out as soon as I found out, I grabbed, I grabbed the camera and I just started talking to the camera because Tanae was cooking and Ashley was like downloading the album. Because the thing about it is, at first, nobody could understand what Tiffany was saying right. because it wasn't whole words <laughs> or sentences. It was just like, because ah, ah, ah. we like, if, if you go back to the video, I was just like, yeah, yeah, like, it was like, what? And I was like, I, said, I was like, Tiffany, you not talk to me until you can like form a whole sentence. Like, I was so mad because I just heard Beyonce. I couldn't understand nothing she was saying. It was so annoying. But that one goes, this is kind of like a combo one. That one goes with the very next day we did a uh, review. Mm -hmm. We was like, because at first I was like, let's wait so we can get to know some of the songs. And I was like, fuck that. Alright, we no. doing it today. So we wait till we got off work. We did it. And that video is so funny. Like, we oh my the God. Favorite. People we still comment song. on that video. Like, they still comment on We was dancing. That was a good... That was the best thing Beyonce could have ever did was drop a surprise album. That's, right. That's like, how, I'll, I'll never forget that. Like, thank you, Beyonce. You right. It was just, like the day before Khadija's birthday. I, like, yeah. it's so many things to make you remember. So... Okay, and this is my last one because I really thought we only had to pick five. I didn't know we get to do more. So, um, even though Tiffany hates these, um, the end of the, 
for the end of the year question and answer oh, because yeah. that's when we didn't know if we were going to bring our friendship into 2015 on whether this show was just going to be strictly business or whether we were going to be friends also and as you see we made it into 2015 we are four months in and we're still friends so are we if you don't want to be just let me know but and for right now, we still are friends, and you know, you guys ask a lot of questions, and we answered them all, I think. Yeah, we did. Oh, so, that was a nice video. I like it when y'all ask questions, even though sometimes I'd be like, damn. Right. But you know, what else? Yeah, so my last video, which just came to mind, was- What? Because um, I was going to put it on here, but I just felt like I had too many. It's the video where it was a, a the I know the number one topic was um that Curry Washington had said something bad about Beyonce. Oh and yeah. the whole day everybody who loves scandal and Curry Washington was talking bad about Beyonce and the Beehive. And the Especially Beehive the was day. talking about Curry Washington. They was like, Curry Washington, big forehead ass. Oh, don't no, let's not talk about film. how you used to be a lesbian in all your movies and then they had Beyonce then they had the Curry Washington fans like Beyonce is overrated. We hate the beehive. She not even all that like I got on that camera like all the frustrations I had had in from eight o'clock that morning when we got on that camera at six thirty I went off I went crazy. I really did go crazy. You did. Oh my god. I still remember I i I'm getting mad again because you don't know. But she, it was a stress out there for her because people kept on at Oh my, my god. god. I felt so it was all up in her mentions. It was just, you know, I felt bad for you a little bit. So, um, so, okay, so yeah, we're going to take a quick break and you're going to see some of our number one supporters giving us shout outs and thank yous and all types of love like that. Hey guys, it's Ashley and Uncle Al here, and we just want to say that we're very excited about the show and their 200th episode. Wow, cool as hell. So girls, we want to say congratulations. We love you and congratulations. Congratulations. Love you, girl. Okay. Congratulations to my girls on their 200th video. Of course, I wasn't a part of it, but y'all know Mama Nate is all a part of the show. Peace. I'm Tiffany's mom, and I just want to congratulate Tiffany and Tanea on the great success of their show in the 200th episode. Great job, girls, hoping to be around for another 200. Thanks. So I want to give a shout out to each of the people who just gave us a shout out and I want to thank them individually. The first people I want to thank starting off with Uncle Al who is our producer who we didn't ask to be our producer. He just started watching our videos and just felt like he wanted to, he help, wanted us to help us out. He wanted to help us to get better and to, you know, it, 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 what is it, Excel? Yes. Yeah. Excel, Excel and this you know, just take YouTube the show to a, right, take the show to another level. And he doesn't ask for anything. He calls me and he takes the time out to do these things. He spent his own money on certain things for the show. So I just really, really want to say thank, thank you, Uncle Uncle Al. from the bottom of my heart. And I just know that, and you should just know that when we do make it, that we got you. Yes, of course. And I love him. We're going to have to get him on the camera one day, like on the camera, on the camera. Yeah. I just recently told him that I don't like it when he's here, when we are recording, because Tanea said it very well. It's almost like working in front of your boss when your boss is like standing right over the back of you. Like, even though he's not our boss, he's just, you know. Yeah, he's on quiet. Um, the second person I want to give a shout out to is Ashley, who is now hey, hey. our creative consultant. And, um,. What she's been doing since the beginning of the show, and you know, she started the show off. A lot of y'all may know her because she was one of the hosts. hosts, but 
the camera isn't for everybody. I will tell you that some days it does get a little crazy. You know, we oh, might get yeah. called a couple of fat bitches, bitches. and a lot of different. Sometimes, uh, which is rare, our schedules are conflicted, so we all couldn't get here together. Mm -hmm. And me and Tanae are more chattier, and she's definitely more. She's she being a creative, real chatty cat, right? So. Being a creative consultant is definitely a better job for her. She's very creative, and we have a lot of new things coming up that she's going to be a part of. So, um, a lot of the things that we've already bought on, like we always run it past Ashley and different, you know, friends just to get their, you know, thoughts on it. So, right, her title is what she's always been doing, and she also is the person who made up the show there's no show like, like the, the show, show. Mm -hmm. the ending so she made it up so she's definitely a big part of the show so definitely shout out to you smashly ashley we love you we do appreciate you the second person i want to give a shout out to is nay nay mama nay as most of you call her nay. who is tanea's mom also like my mom also um just a shout out to her for being patient because you know, when it's time for us to make a show, we definitely do take over. We need the TV down. When we were in the living room, sometimes we would put her out. We're in another headiness. And you know, I just want to say thank you because she doesn't have to be as cooperative. And right. it's like we literally have this backdrop in her living room. Right. Like we have posters, you know, yeah. in her space. So she doesn't do a lot of things. And she really believes in us. She really believes in us. She supports us. She shares our videos. Deals. She tells people, people about the watch. People this. are her job watches. Like right. she's just really supportive. So she already knows that we love her. But you Thanks, know we love you, girl. And last but certainly not the least, my mother, who this is Say probably no, you guys' yeah. first time ever seeing her on the camera, which. I, I recorded a video of her. I FaceTimed her and recorded it because I didn't get to do it in person today. But um, I'm thinking I might have to call her and record it again because you may not be able to really see her. So, I mean, if, you, if it does look weird or it sounds weird, it's because I'm recording on my camera and she's FaceTiming my iPad. But definitely been a big supporter since day one. Yes, since been, been. Even since, because I, I don't know if I've said it before, but I don't know if you guys all know, I used to have another YouTube channel when, which I kick myself in the ass daily that I did not continue that YouTube channel because I would probably be a big star by now. You feel me? I think it did. Like that was years, years ago, ago, like 2008, 2009. And um, she's, I've always been into video cameras. She's always bought me a video camera. She actually bought our new video camera that we have right now. Anything that I say I need, she's she there. Exists. She does not like it on Mondays and Thursdays when I tell her I can't come over because I have to go home and record a video. But my mother supports me in everything that I do. Yes, she does. So this show was nothing but just more support from her. And she also supports Sinead. She supports this household. Yes. Definitely. Anything that I say that I want to do or I believe in, she jumps on board. She does not like Beyonce or Olivia Pope, but that's, a, that's another video. story. So, shout out to you shout guys. Out to Cindy. We love Thank you so all much. of y'all. Cindy knows that I love her. Cindy knows that her. I love her. My only tag too is Cindy right here on my arms. You guys didn't know. Fun oh, Tiffany fat. Oh. When you get Lene? Uh, she time. said she was going to get Lene like <laughs> tea and her. Nay, nay, coming down her eyes. Probably in that crying emoji. Um, but to you know, just finish off the video, I wanted to say I had a couple of things to say. The first thing that I wanted to say was I had oh, I wanted to talk about the future. The future, what I'm hoping, what we hope for the future of the show, what I'm hoping is that we somehow come out because that's what usually happens you have this one video that just goes viral goes viral and things just take off from there and i'm just hoping that that happens and if that does not happen i'm hoping just like we did with these 947 subscribers that we have right now because we started with nothing right we started with nothing so you know it's people with hundreds and thousands and millions of viewers but the 947 that we have right now, I am proud of because it was no cut corners, no favors, no sneaks. We really worked hard to get those subscribers. And 
I'm hoping that we blow up. I'm hoping that one day we have a reality show. I'm dying to have <laughs> a reality dying show. I'm dying to have a reality show. Oh my God, I, I definitely want a reality feel show so like bad. my thoughts and opinions should be worldwide and everybody should hear them because I just got a lot to say. We're definitely YouTube's best kept secret. Like, definitely. Because every time somebody discovers us, they're just like, oh my God. Like, I, know. I don't even know. You, know, you, say, you know. So I just like it. And I'm hoping that, you know, like she said, more people know who we are. We get more out there. BET, I know that time I flipped out on you. Ah! So, um, <laughs> that time y'all had Karuchi talk about, about Blue, Beyonce, Ivy, Baby, Blue, Blue Ivy. Blue Ivy, but I apologize. VH1, TLC, <laughs> MTV, um, MTV TV1, Four, five, six, seven, eight, like, nine, if you need us, just lifetime. call us. We can do interviews. You can interview us. You can right. do a daily show on two fans. Like, I mean, Yo. you just let me know. But I'm just hoping that even if it doesn't happen like that, because if most of you don't already know what you should know, the Scorpion Show is a show that I look up to. I love the Scorpion Show. The Scorpion Show is another show that, you know, he built his way up. He definitely had friends in higher places than we do and he had a couple of viral videos which one of my favorite is when um they made a skit from precious that is the that funny. really i really, really wanted that's probably what made me subscribe yeah that was a funny funny it's video so funny so yeah so you know whatever happens happens and if we have to take it slow we just have to take it slow because god knows right not only is it like it has become like a job I enjoy doing it. I it really, definitely is my Some fun. days are better than others. True I will day. say some topics are better than others. Some days me and Tanae don't like each other. Some days we really do we like, like each, each other. other. So it just... But it's I just feel like you get when you have two females. It's a lot of emotions, a lot right. of feelings. And I feel like at this point, unless something tragic happens that we can't stop because people look forward to us. We were gone for two shows. And my Twitter was blowing up like, where I just want y'all to guys? know that if something tragic does happen to Tiffany, I'm going to keep on doing these videos because I, I told her to. it's something that she would want me to do. I did. I told her. I told her that she should continue to do it. I don't know who my new co-host will be, but I'll get one probably like after a year. Yeah, and um, it's just been crazy, like, from the videos that we don't do in the house when we go to wherever we go we go to different like we did the video in Atlantic City we did the video in New Jersey we did a video down in downtown Baltimore we've done videos in the living room we've done videos in Snares we've done videos in Nene's room we've done videos on the porch and everywhere everywhere from the old intro to the new intro to the sp I can my friend Simone has been on the show. My friend Karan has been on the show. The kids Ash have been, been on, on the show. show. The Kari, kids. Joey. Kari, Joey. I have to get Rex. Rex was on the he don't Myrtle need to Beach be on one. Show. But, um, yeah, it's just been a lot. Nene, Aunt Luann. You know what? We didn't want them on the show. It's been a lot of people in and out, and I know that I, one of the main, the number one things that I miss is I do sometimes miss being in the living room, but in order for us to, I'll never forget when, because the, the Scorpion show was known for doing videos right in their living room, I'll, and I'll people would move back and forth, and it was like when he decided to get the backdrop and he moved to a different location in his house, right? It was so different. Like, it took me so long to get over it, and I didn't understand it then, but I understand it now because sometimes being in the living room, it is funny sometimes when they name or people, it's a distraction. It makes us lose our thought, and it pisses us off. Right. So, so I mean, this is to bring us higher. I definitely do miss the living room, and I miss our old intro. We're actually, I told Uncle Al that we would use the intro that we have now for six months. Because we don't want to keep switching it, and then we'll do another one. I really like the old upbeat one of us yeah. dancing and getting zam. Yeah, but we really did F stuff up. And um, just a couple of quick uh, little behind the scene things that you guys don't see. I mean, what usually happens when we do the videos, like let's say today I get home, I set the camera up and stuff. We were going out of town, so the other yesterday, we actually did a video yesterday, we had to set this back up. Sometimes me and Tanae have arguments right before hitting the record button. Oh my god, like right before. Some t one of the worst ones was probably, but y'all, you'll never know when it is because we, I, I've learned that 
first of all, I try not to argue or have an attitude or be upset or whatever I am feeling discussed it until after the video because as a female, as a human, you know that that could really just change the whole atmosphere. But one of the ones I remember clearly was uh, our q and I think I had on a, um, I had a bucket hat, but it was Army Fatigue. It was our Q&A. And um, me and Tanae had a bad argument before that. So that's one. And it's another one. one. It's a scandal one. It's a, I think it was Yeah, like, it is a scandal one. And I was pissed. Like, and we I didn't, didn't even have I didn't, I didn't even get myself phone. together for the camera. I was still mad. On no, the it's a. The, see, it's and everybody kept on saying, like, this is a really good yeah, show. The, and I was like. I know which one you're talking about. That It's two of them, actually. That scandal one that you're talking about, but that was actually like a scandal recap. Yeah, it was a recap. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. And the one that I'm talking about, I remember I had on a striped sweater, and that's how mad I was. I didn't even put on my uh, my Olivia Pope shirt. But you know, that's some that's how things go. go. Sometimes you can't. If that's why we need a reality show, because sometimes people recording, you know, Nay Nay and us get into an argument. At, as y'all usually hear, like, Ashley or Simone is coming oh, through the door. Oh, or me and Ashley will argue bad. Yeah. We've argued on the show. Yeah. A couple of them. So. Yeah. Thank you. And you know what? That's another thing I wanted to talk about, because people always ask, like, you know, why did y'all go from two to three? Well, I just kind of explained some of it, but I did realize, which I didn't get to. Remember, it was something wrong with the, um, I don't know if it was something wrong with the computer or the camera when the elevator event happened with Beyonce and me, you, and Ashley recorded the video, mm -hmm. but I never got to upload it, and I was so pissed off in the video. I was so pissed off. I was pissed off for, for several reasons. I was pissed off because Beyonce was going through something. I was pissed off because people was talking about Beyonce's family, and then I was pissed off at Ashley and Tanae because it needs to be me and Tanae because Ashley and Tanae just, it's almost like three people just trying to talk over each other constantly. It's yeah. just, it was a mess. It was, yeah. So, you know. It was already a mess. I'm glad that we've evolved and gotten better. Exactly, but you know, things ain't gonna change around here. I mean, things made, you know, little poster board, I mean, little backdrops and little back rock, black drop backdrops and shit like that might happen, but we always gonna be ourselves for the next 200 videos. So, you know, I'm hoping by the next 200 videos that we have way more subscribers, definitely way more views. I'm actually gonna set my phone up right now so we can actually take a selfie on video with my new selfie stick. Go girl. You feel me? Uh -huh. So that we can remember this moment forever. Oh. I wish that I could have this moment for You're a girl. <laughs> like a real one. Are we taking a, a picture on um, while we're recording? Yeah. Okay. We ain't got nothing but time. Okay. Alright, wait, our shirts. <sighs> oh, you can't see you, so. Point to your shirt. This is too much. <laughs> okay, but we have um a little we were supposed to have cupcakes. Uh, that's another thing. Things always are supposed to happen a certain way. And it never does. And it never that's does. That's another reason why, you know, this is a, a great show. Because a lot of things happen that's not. But we, before we light that, I just. No! Oh, yeah, I broke it. I broke it before it started. Before we start this, I just want to say um, that I really, really have a great co host. I'm so happy that Tiffany asked me to do this with her. Um, because if it was anybody else, I probably would say no. And I wouldn't be as um, committed or, you know, because I really don't like a lot of responsibility. But I just want to say thank you for letting me do this with you. And congratulations on our 200th. Ah! I'll do it. Congratulations on our 200th show. And I hope that, you know, when we get to 400, we have double everything. Double subscribers, Yay! double viewers, double. That's what I was going to do when we got half. Of I wanted to weeks. light this first and then. Well, I didn't know how long mine was going to take. Okay. Because okay. so, well, you know. that was straight off the dome. I like it. If y'all ain't know. I like it. But um, hopefully we'll have, you know, double subscribers Be and less weight on us because, you know, that's all I want is a fat, bit, is a fat butt and a flat stomach. We were supposed to have okay. wine, but. I don't drink, so we're having iced tea. Okay. I drink. We were supposed to. Sometimes I do drink wine, but not today. Okay. But um, I just wanted to 
say that I, I wouldn't want to do the show for anybody else other than my best friend. So I'm glad oh that. Oh Really? Yay. That's now. That's real. I really wouldn't want to do the show for anybody. That's but not heavy. Now. We stay best friends. Can I finish? Okay. Go ahead. And um. I know that I can get on her nerves sometimes because I like things a certain way. Me and her are kind of night and day sometimes, but I just hope that we actually do blow up. I know we're going to blow up, and I wouldn't want to blow up with nobody else but my best friend. Oh my god, thank you. My so mother. here's to our 200 video. Okay. Can I take this to the head or just sip it? Sip it. Oh, let me put my pinky up. I was really thirsty. <coughs> Happy 200, one, three. One, two, three. Oh, I thought we was pulling out. We were out. I thought we was <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. One, <laughs> two, three. three. you guys go out on our old intro that's gonna be what ends the video but as yeah. always if you didn't know now you know now you know that there is no show there is no show okay yep singing edition all right like the show like oh the show. and before i go the i don't know how i did this because it's on the paper and that should have been the first people i think i have to thank the viewers i don't like so. to call the viewers which i don't have to say all the time because every time i talk to you guys i'm constantly saying how much i love y'all i love our viewers, we have, viewers. Love our viewers. we have viewers who have been watching since we started 200 videos ago right so shout out to y'all because without y'all we would be absolutely nothing, nothing. we wouldn't have a channel absolutely we nothing y'all mean everything to me oh my god everything yeah everything oh my god say bye to the people howdy y'all i'm hungry woo 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 <laughs> Yeah.